Well done. No. Well done. No. No, no day. Oh. What's up, guys? And welcome back to another video. Why did I buy this bike? I have all the choices I had. S1000, double R, single R's, Super Dukes, uh, M207s, M209s, the lot. Why did I pick the 790 Duke? Uh, why have I gone this way? Can I go this way? Yeah. Doesn't make a difference. Don't know why I went this way. Anyway, why did I buy this? So, obviously main reason is price at the end of the day. Um, kind of having, having a budget is, is what works. And um, at the current stage I'm at, um, this is this is the budget I've got. Yeah, obviously, if you haven't seen already, uh, go watch the little clue videos. Uh, all the kind of clues that I put in that you guys missed. Because uh, you actually saw this bike up for sale in, uh, in the video. So, the main reason was, obviously, price. And I basically got uh, an insane deal on it. If you remember, I got a crazy good deal on the Jix 1000. I obviously swapped my R3 for it. I then got a crazy good deal on the CB500X because they put the dealership put the wrong price up and basically when i found this uh i'm 99 percent sure they did the same thing and put the wrong price up uh because this was up to just over five grand for a 790 duke now 690 dukes are going for that and if you look anywhere online the 790s are five and a half upwards uh and i got it less for that uh less than that less than, i got it for less than that so i couldn't really have said no when i saw it uh, I was looking for like a naked, like an M209 and stuff, and I, I, I kind of, as I said in my um, first ride video, I was very much wanting to get uh, the 790 when it first released, and I always had a little soft spot for it, and always wanted, you know, said it was going to be my uh, my next bike. So um, when I saw this one's up for the for that price tag, I was like, well, I can't really say no, and I've just all right, sat nav. We went over to Fowler's, me and the missus, and she sat on the back, and she absolutely loved it. And I was like, right, she's given me the go-ahead. I'm committed. This is the one I want. I love the sound of it. I love, you know, the growl that you can get. And the exhaust I've bought, I know I was like, right, that's the exhaust I want. I saw a picture of it with that exhaust. And I was like, yes, that's... This is everything I want. The sound the power i wanted something around the 100 uh, 100 brake horsepower mark um it's not for, nothing crazy i want something light and flickable uh did i say sound <laughs> sounds a massive important thing for me and i love the looks of it um obviously the scalpel was a big influence i love you know that that was the bike i want and i found ways of making it look similar to that and i got talking to a few people and looked at her reviews and everything was pretty good on this every review looked at even 44 teeth review on this they loved it and i thought for the price tag everything you get you can't go wrong so i actually paid pretty much the same price for this as i did my hypermotard and everyone you know you i love that bike and i think this is a, an even better bike for what you get for the money and i've gone the complete wrong way the way i wanted to go i wanted to go like a really nice cinematic route i think uh well the route i went here and i kind of i fucked that so yeah We're back down at the wait we are are we there's no way That's we are down by the bottom so instead of walking up all those things, you should have just walked that way. Think with my ear. Mm. Oh, you're recording. No. Don't put that in. Okay. Yeah, that, that's the main reason I bought this bike. And um, why kind of why did I want a naked bike? Well, I've had the sports bikes now, and I I, I do love them. Um, I wouldn't mind having another one, but. For, for what I use my bikes for and every day, I just realised... Are we by the suspension bridge? Uh, I just realised I didn't need a, another 1000cc sports bike. It was just... I felt like I would just be underpowering it. You know, I don't do track days. Uh, I mean, I want to do track days with this. Oh, that's a nice Ferrari. 94J plate. I think mean, that's a fucking expensive plate as well. I feel like I just... I, I don't know, I just wouldn't use it and I'd feel bad. But, uh, you can use all of this bike on the roads pretty much because the torque is where it's all at and this thing has got so much torque and the way it handles it and, and, and produces that power is 
it's on another level this bike it really is if you haven't had a chance to ride one do because you'll understand why i liked it and i didn't even get a chance to ride one it just went off reviews and there's not a lot of bad things to say about these bikes so the other reason why i wanted a duke over like an mt09 was my channel started shut up my my channel started with the duke and everyone knows that i love my dukes the ktms i just everything about them um they might not be the most reliable things from the 390s downwards but um yeah i don't know i've got a soft spot for ktm and there's no exception here so I, as much as i love the m209 and I, I haven't really got anything bad to say i think I, the, the sound of it is, is amazing and the, you know even the talk on that but i have a soft spot for ktm ever since my duke and having another duke and getting back on a duke everything's familiar to me and i, I it would be fucking awesome to have back on the channel having a duke and um just an, obnox an, an obnoxiously loud duke and i thought yes that's that's what i want that's kind of where my brain went of why i bought this and the fact that i got it for that price tag so if you're in a market for something like this seriously for what you get for the value of money for this thing it's you know you can't go wrong really you know my hypermotard a 796 cc engine um for the same price as this which is a 799 cc engine with more power more torque more electronics less miles and it's newer <laughs> you know it's a no-brainer should be in the next week or two my exhaust comes i want to get a dyno run first as it is then i'm going to do with the aftermarket exhaust then with the power commander or, or the one i get with the exhaust um and then dyno run it again and see see how much power we're making out of this thing i would like to you know hit 120 brake horsepower mark i think that's where i want to kind of get out with this thing um and save a little bit of weight here and there i want to put rng crash protection on it so that's gonna add weight um but overall that's that's kind of my plans with this thing oh i know where we are i walked here one time go on sugar tits i just freaking love this thing there's so much i want to do to it so many videos um start a build series soon uh, i'm gonna do some acf 50 tomorrow um do little protection bits and bobs here and there and uh, i'll film that but yeah that's the main thing that's the main reason i bought this thing is there's so many modifications you can do for it as well um fuck me i need to get used to 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 uh to motor vlogging it's been a while hasn't it it's been a real while but now we've got the new bike and everything it's gonna it's all gonna come back together and um i'm still debating on putting a master cylinder on from the super duke um i can't decide if i want to because i really like this the reservoir and I, I think you have to change it um i don't know actually uh, i haven't looked into it that much but i think the brakes are as fine as it is but i'm just like but they could be better you know what i mean i think if i i want to do a track day and i think i think i'll decide after track day if it needs more braking power or not i think that's what we'll go for um if it's going to be this year or not i don't know i'm saving till see if i can get a last minute booking somewhere close like castle coombe or something gone the complete wrong way um from where i wanted to go i wanted to go somewhere nice shut up okay thank you um yeah i wanted to have a nice scenery but i mean you haven't seen this bit before you know you know i'm more like i, I try and get some different scenery in videos but yeah that's that i mean that's pretty much the video that's you know people are asking me why why the 790 why didn't you get like a, an s1000rr and you can pick up the 2010 s1000s for like eight grand now so three grand less and you get this bike and i just i don't know i reckon i could keep up with an, uh, an s1000 obviously it's down a straight line no but off the line i reckon i'd have it um you get launch control on this so uh same with the the, the, the s1000 um but i mean the weight and the torque on this thing's nuts uh, obviously he's going to beat you on a straight line but it's, it's all around the corners all the roads that you see me on cheddar this is perfect and i actually raced one of these once on my r3 and you know what i i, I like to boast well about my r3 because i fucking ragged the shit out of that thing and i was doing really well um <laughs> she was hitting my bag i wondered what she was doing she's fucking dancing 
Um, but yeah, I, I, I was keeping up to him, and then uh, we got to we were coming up the hill, and he gunned it past me. And I did have a video of it, and then uh, I wiped everything on my computer somehow, and uh, I lost it. So yeah, I mean that was kind of a, another reason why I bought the bike, because after seeing riding with someone that had one, and and seeing them in person, and, and everything else. Because when I saw it go from the scalpel to this, I was really disappointed. I wasn't interested anymore. I actually seen it in person, sitting on it at Fowler's. And this is the missus gave me the go-ahead. That was it. I was having it. <laughs> so, I mean, I still love it. And I hopefully I will love it for for many years to come. Because I want to keep this bike for as long as possible, really. I don't normally. Hehehehe. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's funny watching kids. <laughs> oh, I love it. it. Smells like the weeds. It's probably like a fucking shop. Bristol, I wouldn't be surprised if it sell weed in just a shop. Stinks, absolutely stinks though. Oh dear, they're broken. They're broken down. Oh dear. Um, we had a really good response off the, the review video, uh, the reveal, the reveal, the last of one of them, the reveal video. You guys fucking smashed that, so I really appreciate that, guys. Um, obviously, again, pluggies, um, go follow my Instagram. Um, yeah. I'm trying to get better and I'm shit with outros and I don't know when to answer anymore and I feel, oh, you, at the moment I'm feeling like I never, the, the videos are like really quick like I think oh yeah I'm gonna plan this video out and it's gonna be really cool and stuff and it never seems to be that way I always feel like a, a cut video short, I don't, I don't know, you let me know you let me know, you do you want videos longer, do you want me to just get straight to the point do you want me not wasting, wasting uh, your time with uh, videos like this of where um, you know just kind of just explain to myself or you, you just want to see some funny fucking videos of shit i've got planned because i do uh, i really wanted to jump that way uh, yeah yerp um that's fucking sick isn't it but yeah i mean this is pretty much the end of the video at this point i'm just blabbering on uh i've said why i want to bought it and it's the price simple as really and it, you know it takes all the boxes so that's, I could have literally done this video in two seconds. Price, tick boxes, the missus gave me a permission. That's 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 the end of the video. Bye. Uh, come on. Come on. I don't know why I went this way. This way is so much longer than I I don't want to go that way. I want to go that way. Oh, and uh the missus doesn't know this, but I've worked out how to wheel it already. Uh, we can parallel it pretty easily, that's nice and simple. But I was trying to clutch up, but it wouldn't, but I know how to do it now. I'm not going to do it with the missus on the back, plus I've got all my camera equipment on me, so... I'll pass for now. I mean, obviously I wouldn't do it on public roads. Duh. It's just... Hey! <laughs> how did they catch up? <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, I haven't even even outro yet, have I? <laughs> oh, guys. 
thank you very much for watching all my videos i really do appreciate it you know i ain't no one special and um for you for just you know just to subscribe and and and, and watch the videos is is mind-blowing to me so i really do appreciate it it means the world to me for for you guys to watch my content and enjoy it so thank you very much much love and i'll see you in the next one as soon as the as soon as the temperature starts to increase and lockdown's over the boys will be out and then the fun begins So anyway, I love you and leave you, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Fill this bad boy up with some pre-99. Yes, please. Would you like to say hello, Sashi Bum? It's been a while since they've seen you. Why were you flirting with little kids? Flirting. <laughs> <laughs> the woman looked at me and was laughing at that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they tried racing us as well. Yeah, probably. On the on the when we were coming back, you know, I sped up. Mm, yeah, I mean, I definitely didn't speed up. Uh, what am I doing? Uh, yeah, this. I want this. I want this inside of here. That's what she said. He said. It said. They said. I don't discriminate. One, two, three, four. This is Supreme Petrol, alright? Thank God. I didn't even fucking check. Huh? I was like, it's Supreme Petrol, isn't it? Do they do Supreme Diesel? Sure they do. There's more than that in there, isn't there? How many is that? It's only eight litres. Eight and a half. That'll do. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Okay. Did you say that at the same time? <laughs> Pop it, lock it, drop it. What number am I? Yeah, I tried going the scenic route, then took the wrong route and fucked up the journey, so. Hey, we got to see some kids. Yeah. <laughs> Oh dear. Hiya, uh, number five please mate. She's so beautiful. She's... Lie. <laughs>